All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back. It's me, Addy, again, and I hope you guys are doing all right. So last night, something incredible happened on my YouTube channel. I hit 100 subscribers, all thanks to you guys. The reason I didn't make this video sooner is because I wanted to spend some time with my family yesterday. Uh, I had some plans with them, and I just wanted to disconnect a little bit from content creation and social media and that kind of stuff. Uh, but I'm here today to thank you guys. Right now on my YouTube channel, we are currently sitting at 104 subscribers, and it boggles my mind that we even got here. How did that even happen? <laughs> Actually, I do know how that happened. These past couple days have been insane on my channel. Ever since I posted that Death Stranding 2 reaction video, there's been this surge in subscribers here on my YouTube channel, starting from 75. In less than a week, we went from 75 to 104. 29 people subscribed to the channel, which I completely understand may not seem like a lot to you, but to me it's everything. And I never thought I'd experience something like that, ever. And the fact that this happened is beyond my wildest dreams. And I'd just like to take a second to mention why that was especially overwhelming for me. And it's because it happened through me posting a video related to a game that I hold very, very close to my heart. The game I'm talking about, of course, is Death Stranding. When the first Death Stranding came out back in 2019, that was the first game that I streamed over on Twitch. And then a year later, I made my first YouTube video here where I talked about it. And now we've come full circle, where my reaction to the Death Stranding 2 reveal isn't just the 100th video on my channel, but it is also my most popular, and the one that got me to 100 subscribers. It's just so many things that happened as a result of that, you guys. And that is equal parts surreal, profound, and just poetic to me. My reaction video is not at all something that I was expecting to blow up the way that it did. It's currently sitting at 3,000 views, and it looks like it's still climbing. For a long time, I really did think that I was one of the only ones who truly enjoyed Death Stranding and considered it to be a masterpiece. Almost nobody that I interacted with shared that opinion, and I was even made fun of by some people for liking it. Uh, and so when I got the response that I did to my reaction video, I was very moved. What I saw warmed my heart. Uh, I saw so many people not only watch, like, and subscribe because of the video, but also band together in the comments in such a pure way, sharing their own love for the game. And for that, I just want to say from the bottom of my heart, uh, thank you guys. Thank you for making me realize that I'm not alone, and that there are others out there who can empathize with my love for something that means so much to me. But I also want to take a second to express my gratitude to everyone here. Everyone who supported me and my dream in any way, shape, or form, be it through stopping in to say hello on Twitch, to clicking that subscribe button here on YouTube. Over the past two years of creating content here on YouTube, my channel has seen a very gradual yet meaningful growth for me, and I wouldn't trade those first two years for the world. Making videos for YouTube and doing live streams on Twitch has sincerely and honestly been the most fun thing I have ever done in my entire life, and I owe discovering it all to my very good friend Eric, who encouraged me to enter this world back in 2019, before the release of Death Stranding. Of course, this was a game that I knew I was going to fall in love with even before I played it, and I was so excited to play it, and had I not mentioned that to him, he never would have given me the suggestion to begin streaming which then led me to creating content for YouTube down the line, which then eventually got me sitting here today making this video. I really don't know what I would be doing now if it weren't for Eric, but I would imagine that I would be somewhere and do something that I don't enjoy as much as what I'm doing here. A place where I wouldn't be creating so many memorable moments around the very thing that brings me the most joy, those being video games, alongside all the lovely people who I've had the pleasure of meeting along the way. So Eric, if you're watching this, thank you man. And to all of you who thought I was worth something and clicked a button that not only makes a number go up, but also helps my self-esteem and encourages me to keep on doing what I love the most in the entire world here. Thank you so much, you guys.
And I know, I know it does sound like I'm making a thank you video for 1 million subscribers or something like that, which I know is obviously never going to happen. Uh, and I can totally understand if you guys think I'm being overly dramatic just for 100 subscribers, right? Like, what the heck is wrong with this little dude with 100 subscribers? Why is he acting like he's the king of the world or something? Because, <laughs> yeah, admittedly, 100 is such an inconsequential number, right? Uh, especially when you consider that everywhere we go on this platform, we're always used to seeing numbers in the millions, 10 millions, and these days, even the 100 millions. And it's so easy to think that anything less than those isn't a lot. But when I take a step back and visualize 100 subscribers as actual individuals, say in an auditorium where I'm surrounded by people watching my content, that blows my mind. Because to me, it's a lot. And more importantly, to me, it's people who genuinely care about what I'm doing. And I'm eternally grateful for that. So guys, please do something nice for yourselves today, just like you've done here for me. Stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as always, keep on keeping on.